Hello, I'm a vocable object for it, and welcome back to the same world. I figured that out that level. Golly. These levels are getting progressively harder. And if they didn't have little story tidbits, then I would skip. <laughs> Not as easy as I would have liked, but I got it done. <laughs> there were two worlds. In two worlds in the void, they swallowed each other. Huh. That doesn't sound healthy. Okay, please don't be hard fudge. Um Gosh darn it. Wow, um... Let's see... Yeah. It's getting close to somewhere. Um Yeah, new level means new stuff. I have a feeling that this part is correct. So let's see. That's a problem. That's a problem. That's a problem. Oh, yeah. Um, yesterday I was watching Garen Logan, and, you know, golly, it's such an awesome show. But about. As I was watching it, I realized, um, the humans in Gurren Logan are kind of like the monsters in the underground, but at the same time, they're like the humans from Undertale. Well, I mean the underground, I mean... Yeah. Undertale, but, um, mainly because both parties are stuck underground, um, because of a certain race, and also because, um, they, compared to, like, if you compare humans to Beastmen from Gurren Logan and humans to Monsters and Undertale... Humans both possess a trait that monsters aren't very able to really control. Mm. You know. In Gurren Logan, it's similar to determination. It falls, like, kind of closer to evolution. Like, your will to evolve. But it it's pretty similar, I think. Uh, let's see here. Oh, there's a third one. I thought you were a block. Roadblock. Um, oops. 
Okay, now I know that, so let's try that same plan. Wait, um... That should work. And ta-da. But yeah, there's just there's just something interesting that occurred to me. You know. I never expected that, but I'm like, eh, that's kinda of similar. It was a cataclysm. Everything became ashes. Golly. Uh it's just similarities that I notice. Um, just something weird. Though, um, to the Beastmen's credit, they only don't have that ability kind of because they are clones. You know, that's the only reason they can't evolve. <laughs> Nope, that's not gonna work. <laughs> that doesn't work because I gotta go all the way around. Okay, let's see. <laughs> I should be able to get it this time. Boom. Um, that should put me somewhere healthy, um, fudge. Let's see. Do to do to do. And I get stuck there. I get stuck right there. Let's see. So this just needs a little bit of revising. <laughs> Wait, what if I actually just went this way? No, I can't go that way. Because then I'm cutting off so that stuff. Okay, so it's thin that to there. <laughs> Shoot. Um. <laughs> that's definitely correct. Hmm. What if I did this instead? Fourth. Up and down. Fudge, man. <laughs> Not giving me a lot of leeway here. No. Um, it's symmetrical, so maybe start this way instead. <laughs> um, and use this to connect that. No, that's leaving holes. Fourth fudge. Um, what about no? That's not gonna work. <laughs> and now that back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. golly, man.
and then you leave, end up leaving three undone there. Okay. What if I did something more like that? Do something a little bit weirder. Okay, let's see. Man. Darn it. <laughs> okay. Anyway. Fourth, back and forth. Um. Okay, there. Back and forth. Down, up. Ah, come on! <sighs> Man. Um... What if I start from the center? Down. Going and done. Ta da! A man tried to save the world. Both of them. And he probably got brutally murdered. So yeah. This kind of gives me... I don't know why, but it's reminding me of Dust and Elysium Tale. That was a really good game. Um, just amazing visuals and story. And stuff. That leads to many loose ends. Man, that almost works, so... Um... That might... No. Because that's two loose ends right there. Um... But it seems like that was something... That's usable. A gully. <laughs> Man. Um, so the idea Gally, oops. The idea of that works pretty well. That might be the solution. And ta-da! Oh my gosh, I'm flying through these with wild colors right now. Yet it was far beyond man's power. That's sad.
<sighs> it always sucks when you can't really do anything about a situation. Like, when your video game character, like, literally has no choice but to die, that's always sad. <sighs> it's like, you love this character? Well, too bad. How dare you love this character? We're gonna kill him off. And then you're just, like, Oh. I've grown attached to that character. How dare you? Now I'm thinking of Homestuck. <laughs> uh. Andrew Hussey does kill his characters off often. Man, still not getting what I need. Uh, let's see. Let's see, what do I need? Um, maybe something like this. Nope. Okay, so the top needs to either go completely black, or it needs to at least half go black. So, try that. Mm. I mean, at least because of these blockage things, I know what color I need to end on, so that kind of makes it convenient. Shoot, I would hate for this to be another one. Golly, these ads are... Man. Just too many of them. Um... Maybe I leave the top alone, and I have a place to go back to. And let's see, there's that, which that didn't do much. Um, made them mostly white. Let's see. That's, and now that's disconnected from everything. Hmm. I'll try a couple more times, and then I will call it as something that I need to just, well, actually, that, that looks pretty good. Um, shoot. <laughs> I did something like that, right? Um. Damn. Almost looks like something I could work with. Let's see. Well, now that really looks like something that I could almost work with. It's just not quite there. Um. 
What if I actually made a whole side dark? And then maybe put that in. No. Well, um, like normal, I will try to complete this in my off time, and Garin Logan is like a reverse Undertale, and if you haven't, check out my other stuff. The next thing I'm doing is... Fudge. Actually, the next thing I'm doing is probably the Garin Logan opening, unless I do Night of Nights first. Whichever comes first. And until then, bye.